Right, so we, with uh, our brother Elijah, we at his home, which basically, uh, this is the property that has been rented. So, so we're just going upstairs in Elijah's house. This is um, where everyone has been staying. And uh, there are currently nine brothers that are, are staying here. And we're just going to check if the guys are awake. And uh, there is Brother Apoku. Morning, my brother. How are you doing? Wonderful. You have a good night's sleep? Praise God. That's wonderful. Ah, there they are. Look at the boys. Guys, morning. How's it going? Brother Jim. How are you? All right, man. I'm in my little office here. I can see that. Yes. But, <laughs> but you brothers look very rested. <laughs> eh? <laughs> Unlike us, because we were taken to the prayer vigil till 3 a.m. Oh, my. 3 a.m., guys. Oh, you were saying 30 minutes. Yeah, that's what we were told. <laughs> Up the stairs is their, their home. This is the kitchen. So this is Elijah's wife. Introduce your wife to us, Elijah. Okay, her name is uh, Estelle. Estelle? Suzanne. Suzanne. Estelle, Suzanne, yes. Amen. She's my wife and she has two sons with me. Praise God. Amen. And uh, we're in her kitchen and she's been uh, cooking for uh, a week and a half for various guests that have arrived, the brothers, various brothers from Africa, nine of them living in the house. And she's been working flat out, day in, day out, uh, preparing meals, and looking after these guests and so this is what the kitchen looks like and um, you can see that uh, Estelle is uh, joyful amen and she's yeah. mm. so with the guests being here for so many days Elijah and, and she's still joyful Praise God for that. Amen. Wonderful. Wonderful, my sister. Thank you. And this has also been used as the church facility. And so, Elijah, just explain to us um, when, when you started here and how it has developed. We started here in March. We started uh, with uh, with services, uh, with other evangelism campaigns in the area, calling people come to the Lord. And uh, two months later, we started evening uh, services, Sunday evening services. Yeah. But the morning services started really on July 7th okay. this year, so four months ago. Yeah. So how many people are currently meeting here? Are about 25 people. Okay, currently. 25. Yes. All right, so I'm just going to show you the room where there's Bradman, we're meeting. And this is... This is where the guys have been currently meeting. And uh, this is also largely been used as the GFA headquarters for uh, Cote d'Ivoire. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah. And uh, 25 people have now outgrown this room. Yes. And so we're trusting God to put up a, a, a structure, a roof, um, and a concrete floor um, outside the outside the uh, building here. So let's go and have a look at that area quickly, Elijah. Okay. Just show us where that is. And we're just walking back through through the kitchen. And so outside here, as you can see, the, the floor's a, just, it's just sand. And the idea here, um, Elijah, just explain to us what your plan is here. Okay, here we want to roof the place okay because uh, the uh, where we are having services has become very small for us yeah so this place can take at least 80 people it can contain 80 people so we wish to roof the place okay so that we can have conduct all our services here yeah so when you say roof we're talking this entire area of sand yes. we want to cover this whole area yes. with a with a roof all right, and then also to concrete the the floor. Amen. Amen. Well, thank you, Elijah. Thank you Amen. so much, and we trust God for the funds for this project. Amen.